Welcome along everybody to the next commentary playthrough on the channel. Today we're starting Grand Blue Fantasy Relink. Now I might be talking a little bit weirdly because it is literally midnight. I was upstairs asleep. So yeah, I'm a bit quiet. It's probably what it is. But I've been looking forward to this game ever since the demo dropped. Let's just get right into it. Um, we're going to go hard because that's what we do. And let's see what the game has in store for us. been quite nice actually just come off the back of watching kansas city beat uh, baltimore ravens in the nfl afc championship which is nice Shh. it's okay come the stars await and we mustn't keep them Seven days, your crew weathered the storm before finally breaking through the clouds. They couldn't have made it this far without you. It began as a chance encounter with a girl named Lyria. It became a journey to reach the end of the skies. And now, a new chapter in that story is about to begin. What do you say? Shall we start writing the first page? Not too sure about the story and stuff behind this and all the stories. going to go mail. Uh, oh, my name's Paul. I doubt I can get this in. So we'll uh, try that again, shall we? <laughs> Paul plays. Yeah, I'll just call myself Paul. Yeah. Game looks really good. Grand Blue Fantasy Relink. It's so obviously played the demo. That's on the channel. Really enjoyed it. And we've got the tutorial. Move your character with L. Control the camera with R. Yep. It looks like the ship's flying steady again. Let's go check on the others. Anything behind us. Always check behind you, Paul, in these sorts of games. You never know. Could be a chest or something. Doesn't look like it. Yeah, got a massive jump. Let's start here, shall we? Um, Catalina? What is it, Lyria? What do you think is out there? At the end of the Sky Realm, I mean. A wall, maybe? <laughs> if there is, it'd 
should be pretty tall. Oh, now that you bring it up, I guess I've never thought about it before. Hey, can I ask you something? What do you think is at the end of the world? Find out when we get there. We'll find out when we get there. <laughs> I knew you'd say something like that. <laughs> <laughs> On the other hand, we know there's at least two things waiting for us out there. First is Estelucia, the island of the astrals, and second is your dad. So there's a glossary highlighted, so I could probably go into that glossary and find. That's good. Next time that pops up, we'll try. We'll just have to keep going and see for ourselves. Seems like it's almost that active law that we had in Final Fantasy 16. Oh, you're certainly in high spirits, Lyria. <laughs> I'm just All right, let's get in the next one. Yeah, we'll see if that glossary works. Oh, feel that wind flowing through your hair. <laughs> it does have a certain nostalgic quality to it wait does that mean you've been to the sky dump before rosetta oh sweetie <laughs> i can't start giving away my secrets now oh you never give me a straight answer strong lulu vibes eh because you've got no filter maybe you'll understand when you're older zip it i've told you a bunch of times stop treating me like a baby she's right rackham Eo is a mature, sophisticated lady. Two against one ain't fair. I'm counting on you, Eo. And you won't be do get, disappointed. There we go. This is what we want. Yes! I do get um Welch from Star Ocean 4 vibes from Eo. But a mysterious magical form of energy long exists in the sky realm, separate from the power of primal beasts. Yeah. Wow. This going which sky dwellers over through these exiled astral oppressors. Okay. Lots of stuff we can get here. Ugh, if anybody's the immature one, it's Rackham. Oh Eo. Just forget about him. Think about these new skies we get to explore. Game looks stunning though. Playing in performance mode on the PlayStation 5. <laughs> What's with the tune? You put on your happy pants today or what? It's this new Skydom. Reminds me of my younger days. Got me falling in love with the skies all over again. But you can rest easy. I'm keeping an eye on the horizon. Anything comes close to the ship, and you'll be the first to know. Think we'll see monsters? Hard to say. But if I know these airways, the skies will turn on you when you least expect it. Why don't you go check on the rest of the crew? I got things covered up here. We're on the verge of entering a new skydom. No knees up now, Captain. <laughs> Seems like everyone's in high spirit. Should be seeing signs of civilization soon. I hope the island has a hotel. All right, so, yeah, there we go. Heads up, we got monsters. No, back off. Here comes the tutorial. For a square to attack nearby foes, when playing as the captain, you mix in tr triangle attacks to create various combos. Press triangle to unleash the character unique attack. So many attacks can be charged by holding down the button like the captain's attack. Hey birds, were they hiding in the clouds? Eo, Rosetta, could you handle the lizards on the port side? Funny, you jerks. Yeah. Looking good. Away. When a fly goes red, watch out, be prepared to guard or dodge the powerful attacks that's about to come. With L1 to block. Beware, taking too many hits while guarding will result in a guard break. Okay. Nice move, bud. 
dodging. Press R2 to dodge exploit to take damage. You can dodge multiple times in a row. Doing so leave you wide open to after the final dodge. Lucky there. Now we can make a break for Lyria. Captain, go to Lyria. Showed those losers. <laughs> <laughs> you can't mess with the best. Bahama already. <laughs> we did it. Right. Now what are we doing? Come on, ship. Don't fail me now. Time bombs are ticking, people. Fight us! Okay, so L2 uses that. This is, is actually pretty tough, I'm not going to lie. Oh boy, engine room's been hit. We're about to fall under the buoyancy threshold. 
Checking to see what's happening on the floor and stuff here. He's too tough. You guys think we'll make it through this? Hey, we're not licked yet. Muhammad just needs a couple more hard smacks. There's only so much I can do at the wheel. Hurry oh, it up, Boykin. Come on. Skyfall. This distance of agents gonna be iffy. Everyone, hang on to your butts. Ah, you're gonna kill us first, Jackal. Yeah, you see that? It appears we're still alive. That's a start. Bahamut's near the bow. Now's our chance to attack. <laughs> Forgotten Sky. That was a good start. Did have to use quite a few potions there, though. Captain, tucked away in the secluded island of Zinkenstil, nothing exciting ever seemed to happen to this young man or pal. It was pal Verin. Well, that changed when the guy named Lyria arrived out of the blue. Paul's newest adventure unfolds across the western stretch of the sky, home to islands such as Luoting and the Enstido Archipelago. What sort of names is that? The Western Frontier. Let's talk Lyria's about Lancodes through the darkness. It was familiar, painfully familiar. Just like the day we met, before this whole long journey began. Though I could barely use my sword, I tried to protect Lyria from the Empire. I almost died. But then. So I'd like to keep episodes around half an hour. I will go longer for this first one. Just to get you into the game and get rid of the, a lot of the tutorial things off the start. You protected me. Now it's my turn to save you. Take my...
my power. Let it guide you. Let it become your strength. I know you can do this. Our lives are linked. While I may not fully understand how, Lyria gave half her life to save me. Her gift gave me the push I needed to pursue my own quest. Finding Estelusia, Island of the Astrals. It was a fabled place at the end of the sky, where dreams are said to come true. Lyria and I, not to mention our ever-growing crew, are still continuing our search. But someday... Someday we'll find it. Then, finally, the life link between us will... Huh? Where... am I? Oh, right. Lyria fell from the ship. Then Vern and I leapt after her. Right. So one of the things I enjoyed from the um, demo was the combos and abilities, so hopefully we get them soon. Nice. Sun Dappled Grove. Lyria again? Maybe you bumped your head on the way down. Okay. Uh, speaking of Lyria, I didn't see where she fell. She should be close. Let's search the area. Yeah, let's grab her first before we do too much exploring here. I think there is a map. No. Be surprised if there's anything to pick up at this early stage, but you never know. Oh, well, there is. Probably can get across that. Right, one more time. Yeah, can't quite get across that even with the... It's fine. I'm not going to spend half my playthrough trying to do that. Don't mind if I do. Cobblestone. Did see you though. There's one over there as well. Coin and some rupees. It looks like the path continues behind that island. Can you clear it? Looking good. Now let's move on. Okay. What a beautiful setting, though. Probably going to get to a fight here. There yep. She is. 
lock on. Press L2 to have the camera automatically follow a target. When locked on, use R to switch targets. You can take them right. Show them who's boss. You can do it. We know it. Just like that. Wow, oh, come on. Nine. Okay. Did we get all of them? Watch out! Like they've got friends. Skill was press I want and press them to do a skill. Skills going cool enough for us activation. That was good. Skills. Every character has their own support skill. One of the captain's support skills is called Adept Arts, which enhances the abilities of activated skills. Hold to reuse recovery items. Medicine might taste bitter, but it's better than biting the dust. Now, let's lose these trees and meet up with the crew. Okay, let's look at these skills. Still only got them, so he's wind based. Can't select any of the other characters at the moment. Seems such as spellbooks and ambrosias are usable from the menu. Okay, so we need plenty of sky maps then. Okay. Anything of note here, though? This is where we come from, innit? Yeah, we came down. This is the arena that we fought in. Just checking around. Never know what might be here. Let's push on. We're going to get caught up too much. Room. The mushroom. Chest. <laughs> I see the enemies. Neat. Ugh, more monsters. You ready? <laughs> Every character character attacks have skills. And skills have elemental properties. Element is represented by color icon next to the character's skill. Captain's is wind. Most take more damage from elements they're weak to, which is represented by the icon next to the health gauge. The timber wolf is weak against the captain's wind. Hey. We fight as one. Okay, it's not the one I wanted to fight, but.
Okay. chest somewhere. Certainly saw this. Nice. I see a chest. This one maybe it's the one I opened already. Right, so that's the way we they want us to go. I'm gonna head down here. Look, treasure. What's this? Ooh. Glitterstone and rupees. Hmm. I think I can see a path on the other side. <laughs> Looking good. Just like that. More stuff. Again, it's not going to be ground or game breaking. All right, another arena. Nearly dropped. Is this? Some more. Somebody call for the cavalry? You're so corny. Let's just take out my monster already. We're saved. I could kiss you guys. <laughs> Glad to see you too, Vern. Get in position, nice. people. Ah. Do this. Take it out if we link our attacks. Link attack. A foe stun gauge fills up as it takes hits. Once the stun gauge is full, a link chance will trigger. Press circle during the link chance to form a link attack with your party members. Link level. Performing certain actions such as link attacks raises the party's link level. All party members perform a link attack at 100% link level. You'll gain temporary buffs. <laughs> Mode bars and boss statuses. A boss mode bar fuels up as it takes damage. Once full, the boss goes into overdrive and becomes even more dangerous. 
Conversely, if boss's mode bar depletes as it takes damage while in overdrive. Once the bar is depleted, it enters break, your chance to lay on the hurt. Skybound Arts Press, L3 R3. This Gavin Art is full to unleash a devastating attack. Skybound Art gauges underneath your health gauge. Here goes. On me. Tempest Flame. Ha! Catalina, I'll protect you. Fall now. Rest in peace. Back up. Loud and clear. And dust to dust. Yeah. Full burst. When multiple scrub announcers are activated in succession, it triggers a powerful final attack with chain burst, by chaining everyone's SBAs together for a full burst. Chaining Skybrand Arch modes. Press triangle, uh, center, then square to command your party members to either automatically use the Skybrand Arch or to hold them for later. Forgive me for being late, Captain. Hope you save some fun for me. Ooh. Looks like everyone's no worse for wear. Oh, thanks for the save, Oigan. Lyria, about what happened with Bahamut. Do you have it under control now? Yes. I think I do. Uh, why'd it flip out on us? I don't really know. Well, hanging out here isn't gonna help. How about we head back to the Grand Cipher? Uh, Grand Cipher's off ship, yeah, okay. I'm the Beal. Better get moving before more monsters get the munchies. In that case, maybe we should follow this trail instead. I have a feeling it leads to a nearby town. Doesn't that sound like the perfect place to learn more about Zega Grande? But what about the Grand Cipher? She's sitting pretty behind some cliffs past the forest. But that last tussle in the sky dinged her up a bit. Be great if we could grab repairs. Then it's settled. Into town we go. Oh, wonder if they got any plump, juicy apples. Oh, Vern, you're always thinking about food. <laughs> Look who's talking. Uh, my tummy always picks the worst time to growl. Well, this is the hub that <laughs> we saw in the demo. Stomach. Let's go find that town. Okay. Oh, I wonder what kind of city it'll be. Can't wait to find out. See if there's anything to loot. Does not seem you know so. I'm wondering, how'd you guys fall from that high up without a scratch? It's a miracle. Good question. Maybe the canopy broke our fall. Don't mind if I case, do. We got lucky. Hey, any. 
tells you life ain't about luck is a liar in my book. Okay, I can't go into my menu. That's what I was trying to get a read on what that temp stone was. Seems like a pleasant place to unwind. Only one way to find out. Let's go! There we go. I didn't go with power to control primal beasts. Lifelink. Eo. She looked pretty decent in the demo. Rackham. Okay, let's get going. And yes, this is the hub that we had. Check out the airships. Probably got a strong trade network going. Kind of reminds me of good old Port Breeze. Good one is blessed with the Primal Beast Tiamat. Okay. We should look for a place where Lyria can rest. Me? But I feel fine. You've had a rough afternoon today. You shouldn't push yourself too hard. I know, but we're in a brand new town, and I want to explore it with everyone. Well, Captain? Maybe we could grab a bite. Gee, I didn't know our Captain was such a foodie. <laughs> That'd be me. find some delicious apples. Or whatever's tasty. <laughs> if Lyria's up for a little excursion, then I don't see the harm in it. In the meantime, I'll grab the Grand Cipher. Should be a dock around here somewhere. As for me, I'm hankering to try the local brews they got in these parts. We just got here and you already need a drink? What's with you, geezers? What? I deserve a refreshing cocktail geezers. after a long hike. Ugh, you don't deserve anything. <laughs> You're all too much. Anyway, after exploring for a bit, let's meet back at that big building over there. The church looking thing. Okay, do we get to explore the hub? We do. Take a look around. And the claimable add ons are now available. I love visiting new places for the first time. Check out the archives of uh, Lyra's journal to read notes and other documents you've picked up along your travels. Okay. Head this way. Okay, can't go that way. What should we do first? So many choices. <laughs> I have to say, you're a real lifesaver. Well then, see you next time. Shack, that's my merchant of Lefra. This is where we can get our pre-order stuff. Looks like you have some rough coins to trade for for fortitude shards. These are of training coats a minute amount of power out of armaments. Oh, 
Well, I'm going for two here. Yep. Ah, you must be the one Ciro mentioned. Let me take a peek at your gear. That's where we can take care of all of the weapon related. You can also sell your items here. Let's use the forces you shard you traded earlier to level up the captain's weapon. The number of shards you want to use on the weapon. The weapon's level will increase based on how many shards are used. Okay. Ah, uh, idiot Paul. So our HP goes up with that as well. Okay. Navigating towns, icons display to the screen indicate where useful facilities are located. What's your next story objective? You can save your game at any time from the main menu while in town. Let's do that, shall we? Okay, I want to come back here a minute. So, color pack two and three. Glitter crystals, fortitude crystals, and mastery points. False sword of the apocalypse. Some runes. And here's our rewards for the demo. Cool. Using cremate cards to unlock new party members to join your journey. The more, the merrier. You were the counter one, weren't you? Yes. Don't have any crewmate cards. You are really good. I enjoyed you. You're scythe, though. Okay. Okay. I don't have a serial code, so. Don't forget to equip sigils. So we want to go to our gear here. Okay, the false sword of the apocalypse is probably going to break the game, so I'm not too sure we want to play with that. I just had a cough, so apologies. Traits. Increases stock of recovery items. Put attack power 2 in. Health. Just give you potion hoarder. Don't have anything here, do we? Okay. So let's take the explorer in nice instead. Right, you. Side quest. Counts people marked with an icon are in need of help. A good deed never goes unrewarded. Teach them a lesson, will you? Sure. Enjoying yourself? 
It's drunk already. Oh, brother. At least one of us is. That's for sure. Come here. Let you in on a tip I heard. Word is there's a village that runs a mining operation on a nearby island. It's got an altar dedicated to, get this, a primeval god. For beings that has gotten deities in the islands of Zega Grande, the pilgrims of Avia, now, objects of worship and influence the faith virgins. Okay. And when this god stirs up a wind, loads of ore gets exposed, ripe for the plucking. Then this town takes those mined ores to make the finest jewelry. We'd be rich if we got in on the action somehow. You catching my drift? Anyway, gonna stay put and sniff around for more info. I'll let you know what I hear. See you later, Captain. Okay. Seems like there's a side quest this way. There. Crabby resonance. This boy rescues rare creatures called wee pincers. If you find one, they'll be happy to take it in. They couldn't explore the town at all in the demo, really. What's Rosetta doing? Probably better not to ask. Every rose has its thorns, and... Hi, Rosetta! Nice of you to drop by, Lyria. Come to see my part of town? Actually, I wanted to ask you how I could help the crew. Is that so? Well, I'd say there's no need to stress out about it. But I want to be useful and do my share. Oh dear. I think you might be overthinking this. Still, isn't there something I can do? Let's see. Guidebooks are pretty youthful. Ever thought about writing one? Write my own guidebook? Just jot down the fun things you've seen and done. Whatever you want to share with us. Better than complaining all the time. That's like the opposite of being helpful. You're right. Okay, I'll write the best guidebook ever. <laughs> I can't wait to read it. Such a refreshing oh. breeze. The silver key. There's a side quest around here somewhere. Up to here. Cool. We we'll get health one and a fortitude shard. I try to help. Nice. On you. Cool. Don't mind if I do. Another fortitude shard. Okay. There'll be so much stuff in this village that I'm just going to miss. Come this way. Okay, I know we can upgrade our weapon. Why? No, I need some goblin stormers for you. Okay, let's... Go and speak to everyone here before we wrap things up for this first one. Rackham headed straight for the docks, huh? huh? 
airship of that size is a first for me, but I reckon I can handle her. Ah, sorry for pushing you guys. <laughs> Shucks, it ain't nothing. I'll leave this spot empty, so go ahead and fly her in. Thanks a million. I'll get right on it. Rackham, hi! Well, look who it is. I managed to find a place that can patch up the Grand Cipher. Just got done haggling with him. Um, I'm sorry the ship got hurt. That was my fault. Whoa, whoa, what are you talking about? You had nothing to do with it. But I... Look, it was a random accident. No one could have known our dragon friend would go all crazy. Wonder what upset Bahamut. Ugh, beats me. I just hope it's not an omen of bad things to come. <sighs> no point losing sleep over what if. Let's just forget about it for now, okay? <sighs> okay. Thanks for cheering me up. There's that smile. Besides, we're in a new skydom. Let's see some more enthusiasm, huh? Anyway. I'd better go move the Grand Cipher before anything happens to her. Go have fun. I got awesome. the ship covered. Breeze feels almost welcoming. Like an old friend. While we're out of this side of the woods, let's... Sigil is going to be upgraded to blacksmith. The higher the sigil level, the stronger the trait becomes. Sigil rarity determines its level cap. Let's talk. Once your sigil's improved, Don't have the rupees for it or the stuff for it. Okay. What should I strengthen? So we're not going to use the, the false sword of the apocalypse. It's just going to be too beastly. You're likely to be in party. Press square to automatically select the most suitable materials for leveling up. And choose my previous feature makes upgrading a breeze. I'll handle it. How about that? Goes to level 10. I'll handle it. Okay. Let's do Rosetta. I think we'll just do one though. So I think we do one on each of these. Success. Now I'm out of rupees. I'll handle it. Don't forget okay. about upkeep. Can I? Can't select my party, can I? Uh, this is what we saw. Thought to contain a primeval god's vitality. Okay, right, let's get this. Golem finger. Work hard, play hard. Eo. We've come a long way. Hmm. Hey, what you looking at? Yeah! <laughs> you dumb lizard! Don't sneak up on me like that! Ugh, for the millionth time, I ain't no lizard! So what you doing, Neo? <sighs> Checking out the makeup selection. Ooh, that's so grown up. Wow. This elegant lady knows the importance of looking her best. I see. I still don't know anything about makeup. You're naturally pretty, but a dab here or there could bring out a whole new you. Really? Uh, I don't know if that's me at all. It's so PC. This? do our faces together with Rosetta's tutoring of course aren't you curious how Lyria will look captain mm. 
sounds like a good idea. <laughs> Maybe I can be a sophisticated lady too. Wow. Gee, what a selection. I don't know what most of this stuff is for. We're gonna need a key. What's this? No. Prison chip. Let's see another one somewhere. Here. That needs a key, right? Yeah. Uh, okay, let's just head up here. Need of a handy man. We're just exploring here, see what we can see. I so said the chests aren't overly worthwhile. Uh, we spoke to that man there. Okay. Go off piste a little. It's a w need the white wing yeah, key. Okay. Is there a map? Is that a chest? No. Is there a map? Doesn't look like it. Okay. Move up this way. Oh, I saw something in there. Catalina, training again. Guess old military habits die hard, huh? If she hadn't betrayed the Earth Day Empire to save Lyria, who knows where we'd be now? Hi, Catalina. What you doing? Thought I might get in some training. I once spent hours practicing my strikes. Oh, no wonder you're a master swordswoman. <laughs> Not yet, I'm afraid. Maybe I'm halfway there at best. You're no slouch either, buddy. But I wonder who's better, you or Catalina. Probably Catalina. Always be <laughs> humble. It's hard to say at a glance. Though it might be fun to cross swords sometime. You mean like a sparring match? I wouldn't know who to root for. Then why not both? Oh, you're right. There's no rule that says I can only pick one side. Uh, Captain, before we proceed any further, I have just one thing. Make sure to check our mastery points from time to time. Battles may begin to feel tense if we don't sharpen our skills. Masteries. Characters gain mastery points upon leveling up. Mastery points are spent to raise stats, learn skills, and more. Now we have time to see that in action. Let's have the captain acquire a new skill. Okay. For a character to become a powerhouse, let's start with the captain. Each mastery node is unlocked with a mastery points. Select the armor break node. Fast lunge attack that inflicts defensive down on a foe. Effect strength and duration are based, based on our level. Yeah, I think I get it. Cool. We've got 500 of the things, so let's get some more HP. Well, all right. Neighbors use a perfect guard. Guard right before foes attack to land. There was stun gauge and surrounding foes. And perfect dodge. Yeah, I think I get it. This more health. Cause a circle that restores allies HP. I love learning new stuff. Okay, and we'll just get some more attack. Ready for action. Enables you to launch. Press square right after jumping to launch foes into the air. 
Yeah, I think I get it. Okay. I can make use of this. I think for now. Seems useful. HP. Grants invincibility to Catalina. Grants invincibility to entire party instead of instead while Ares is summoned. Ah, fresh insight. Perfect A guard. new technique. Behold, new power. Okay. I think right. what I'll do, ladies and gents, is I'll call this one apart here. I'll go ahead and upgrade all of the skills and stuff off camera. Just and if there's anything decent that comes up, I'll give you a quick run through of that. But you don't want to see me just clicking X for this whole time. So yeah, a bit longer first episode, but that was intended. Yeah, I'll try and keep it a bit more shorter and concise. But please like, comment, subscribe, all of the stuff really does help me out, and there'll be some more Rambly Fantasy Relink coming out shortly. See you all in the next one.